Welcome back, folks, to Darkest Dungeon, and I'm getting rid of Curious off of our abomination because that almost got us into a lot of trouble in the last video, so I don't want to deal with that anymore at all. I also thought about maybe increasing, like, the treatment library, but it should be fine for now. It's about all I can do. You can check the stage coach, see if there's anyone good. A uh, luminous grave robber with the yips. Luminous is good with that plus two speed, plus five dodge. The yips suck with that negative five modifier. Do I really want a third grave robber? I already got two. I mean, one has dark temptation though. Which ain't that great. The other one has, just has Precision Striker and Anemic. I mean, I have space. I might as well, right? Let's look at the Plague Doctor. Plague Doctor has a Zoophobia. <laughs> Irrepressible and Skilled Gambler. Ain't that great. We already have two Plague Doctors. I don't know if I really want a third. I kind of want to get some Medics. Some Vestals. When I mean Medics or cultists or maybe like a man at arms that'd be kind of cool I haven't seen one of those in a while so I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to increase the stagecoat ne network so that we actually have four heroes to pick from instead of just three great heroes can be found even here in the mud and rain I also think I'm going to sell some of these trinkets that we have sitting around here like let's just get rid of the bleed stone Let's get rid of the Warrior's Bracer. The Move Charm, why not? The other Bleed Stone. I don't think I need three Padlocks of Transference. I don't think I need two Camper's Helmets. Look at the other Move Stone as well. And there we go, our gold has increased. Now we just need to go do a run. Okay, so I scraped together a party which I think will work. Um, Flagellant, Highwayman, Jester, Plague Doctor. To detoxify the corpses. Blighted corpses lay strewn about the old road. Teeming with filth and disease, journeys to and from the hamlet pose constant threat of sickness. To start this blight with um, salve. Now we get sunshine in the thicket. Which I have no idea what that does, but it's a town event. Excise the fungal tumors, and the land may yet live. Well, guys, this is what we got. We got the flagellant with the Harper's Hood, the Punishment's Hood. We got the Highwayman with the Legendary Bracer for more damage. And the speed stone to interact with that negative one speed. We got our jester with the lucky dice for a bit more accuracy and dodge. And our plague doctor just has that shimmering cloak for some more dodge. Less healing, but more dodge. And we got our potent salves. And we gotta see how this weird party's gonna work. I don't like not having a dedicated healer, but I mean, that's that's the hand I was dealt with kind of all these no vestals in the <laughs> in the stagecoach. But let's see how we scout. So we know there's a quest location just south of us. And then there's an obstacle, and that's how the map looks. So let's head south. It's just a tree. And the quest location. Let's use that salve. And the infected corpse. And let's do a fight against brigands. Let's do a battle ballad. Increase. Of skill and purpose. Just increase our accuracy and speed. 
I'm gonna stun those two in the back. Don't feel like dealing with them right now. Let's do a duelist of that. For a critical. Very nice. Both those guys are stunned. Point blank shot. <laughs> we just got him. Wow. Very good. We're doing another inspiring tune. As we should. Point blank shot. A victory. For another a beefy crit. Point. Well, let's just punish you. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. And let's blight up this uh, this brigand. We all get a bit nicked from him, losing a bit of our dodge. But he's As pretty screwed. Alright, we got a little bit of food. And uh, some deeds. I'm focusing deeds and heirlooms. For this run, at least. Not so focused on money. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Because I do need deeds so I can actually upgrade <laughs> my buildings. And it looks like there's gonna be a battle right away here. It's fungal scratchers and an acolyte. We're just gonna advance on them. Really high blight resist, so the blight doctor isn't very good against them. Which is a big thing of like, why the hell did you bring the blight doctor here then? Oh, wrong, uh, wrong ballad. <laughs> Meant to do the battle ballad there. Instead, I got rid of two stress or whatever. Let's just get rid of this guy. Ape bleed. He's not much of a threat anymore. There we go. Battle valid instead of inspiring tune. Well, let's just point blank shot for a big chunk there. Uh, let's just kind of throw some plague on that acolyte. He is gonna do a stressful incantation. We can try to help mitigate our stress though, because we do have the Jester. Wow. Joe Land is really doing a lot of damage. <laughs> well, he's pretty screwed now. Let's just heal ourselves up slightly. And well, I guess we'll just cut you. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. We got Blightstone. And now your skills are a bit you could do this, you know, blighting. <laughs> That's pretty nice. Let's move this around. Do we open this up? Uh, I mean, we don't have any space if we do, is the problem. So it's like, why interact with the curio if I can't hold anything? Ooh, we can interact with this, though. Maybe grab some food. There we go. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. You don't need a dedicated healer if you have tons of food. I feel like maybe I should have brought more torches along. Hmm. Alright, another one of these. Well, we're hungry. But then we grab that extra food. I mean, we could battle more and like dim our light. That's a thing I could do. Hmm. 
another wall. Nature herself, a victim mm. to the spreading corruption. Well, let's use our shovel. I should have brought more shovels too. Ooh, I've underestimated. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you want to eat already? Okay. Well, let's enact the old tree now that we have some a little bit of space at least. Gold, Another shovel. That's good. A portrait. Blood. That's what I want. Well, now we got two shovels, so we can deal with two obstacles. And we got some maggots and a spitter. And it looks like a torch that we can grab. Got repost up. Well, let's just do that battle ballad. Give ourselves more speed. Hopefully act before these guys. Got some pretty decent dodge. How quickly the tide you know, that's why you don't mention how good your dodge is. You'll just get crit. <laughs> some blight on you. We're gonna get spit on. Six. We resisted the effects though, which is nice. Uh, let's just inspire yourself. Let's help get rid of some of the stress. Let's punish this guy. Punish him. He's just dead now. Destroy them. Now the highwayman gets to act? No, you get to act. Well, that spider's pretty boned. The slow death. Unforeseen. And we just get one anti-venom from that. We can grab this. Great right torch. And some deeds. Shadowy. Let's increase the light to dim. Another stump. Could interact with that. Let's interact with that. Got a move charm. A torch. Bit of cash, and we're not gonna grab that. Those little gems. Stay with. Nah, let's increase the light to look radiant. See if we scout. We do not scout little bit here. Let's just interact with this box. Bit of crests. Um, I'll drop the gold. I'll grab the crests. This isn't really a money run. It's more of an heirloom run. Get hit. Get blighted on. So let's just heal that away. Also eat a little bit of food. And now we gotta deal with the fungal artillery. Oof. We need that battle ballad. Let's do us some dance. Let's do some punishment. That fungal scratcher. Now do we throw a plug grenade back there or do we go for the stun? I think we're just gonna go for the stun. We were able to stun one of them. We get brains of blight. Which are rather nasty. We get blighted. We do the plague doctor to get rid of those. Let's just throw a blight grenade down there. See if we can blight them back. We were able to. Let's just cut you. So you don't have to deal with that fungal scratcher anymore. We'll get rendered, but we can do a bit more damage back. Uh, I think we're just gonna do an inspiring tune. Try to lower this stress down a bit. More rains of blight. Rare is able to resist. That's good. 
This is how a life is taken. Escape cloud. They all gonna kill him. And we weren't blinded from that escape cloud. Let's punish him. So he's got four bleed, four blight, he's dead. Don't have to worry about him anymore. Let's just get rid of that blight. And we can reset. Great is the weapon that cuts and we win! More deeds. There's some Arbalus Greaves. I think it sells for like 750. Onyx is pretty good. Well, let's light some of our torches. And. We didn't have these potent salves, I would grab these stuff in a jiffy, but we are <laughs> that we are holding those potent salves, so I really can't. But I kinda wanna grab the onyx because that stacks pretty nice for money. The arbalist greaves I could sell. But I feel like I'm just gonna keep everything I'm holding. Hunger again. Jester, how about you eat a bit of the food? I'm gonna have to do some serious backtracking. Dogs! Surprise them. Well, let's punish them. More damage. Let's just stun them. Don't feel like them acting. Let's just duelist advance. Just get rid of that one. Mm -hmm. Let's do that battle ballad so that we're faster. These doggos are rather quick. Rapid rush. Just punish this dog. Convenient that they don't leave corpses behind. And we got a quest location right here too. Kind of blended in with the background. Just cut you up. Able to dodge. Let's get rid of that bleed. Mm, let's stress. We act first. We point blank shot. Ah, oh, one away. We rolled really low on that. We're getting a bunch of money. At least promises success. Let's just eat that food. Let's grab that cash. To deal with the bloated corpse. And. I guess let's just keep going a bit. I can grab this. It's empty. Grab this. Dazzling charm and a tiny amount of money. Plus 10 to our stun skills. It's a bit tempting to actually just put it on the Plague Doctor right now. We're in shadowy light. Okay. Sort of feel like maybe camping after we go to this room here. Locked box, let's remember that. Two ectoplasms. Hit the one in the back. Bleed. 
Let's dice you up. You get bleed as well. You resisted it. Let's just do a Dirk Stab. We miss. Well, let's just do a Noxious Blast then. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Alright, let's go to this empty room. Hey, it was empty. Well, let's just have a camp. Huddled together. Furtive and vulnerable. Rats in a maze. Do the bandit set so we don't get surprised. Let's do every rose has its thorn. Well, you can't turn back time on yourself, eh? Let's do Tiger's Eye on our Highwayman. Go with more accuracy. And we can do a Wound Care as well. Just do it on the Highwayman. Just heal him back up. Good. That should delay our death. I'm coping well, despite the madness all around. Blah blah blah. blah. In no radiance, may we find victory. And let's go do these last three rooms. And then I'll do the backtrack. Which I'll probably cut out. Hello, trap, instantly. Ancient traps lie in wait. Didn't do much damage, though. Unsprung and thirsting for blood. Just gave me a bit of stress. Ah, brigands. They weren't surprised. We can blind them. They do not have very good stun resist. Do us advance for a massive crit. And then we can punish the big guy. The battle ballad. So that we're even faster. Rain of whips. We all dodge and we slice him. All right, we're just gonna do a plague grenade. Go to the cutthroat. Point blank shot. Just size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. And we're just going to punish. And they're just screwed. <laughs> so let's just inspire yourself, Jester. Great. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Yep, dim light. Let's just light that torch. Let's grab the bus. Let's grab the money. Unlock strong box. Remember that for later. Ooh, food. We can collect that later. We do have shovels still. Good thing we picked up the extra shovels. Alright, so it has to be here. These quest locations were rather spread out. Hi, spiders. We surprised you guys, thankfully. Just to do us with that, so we're a big crit. Because our crit rate is rather nice with that 20%. Just punish. Time to do like a Dirk Stab. Maybe kill one. I think I'm just going to do a Battle Ballad. Alright, he's dead now. So we're able to get rid of half of the spiders before they've been able to act. And we're dodging really nicely. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Let's do a point blank. A beefy crit. Didn't see that one coming, did ya? 
I kind of did, because you've been critting a lot. A lot, Joe. You've been critting a ton. Let's just do that inspiring cry. He's dead. Uh, anyone need a little bit of healing? Well, the jester. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Nice. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzy. Let's get rid of that shovel. Let's grab the jade. Don't need that. Do you have any like? No, we are all full up on trinkets. Well, there's a grave here, which I could have used that shovel on, but nah. I think I'm good. Alright, so where on earth is that infected? Curio, curio, curio. curio. Did I miss it? Curio, curio. I walked right past it! Why? Oh my god. I just, I walked right past the damn thing. Okay. How many of you guys were screaming at me for walking right past that? Raise your hand. Now put it back down. I gotta kill fungals. I can't believe I did that. I would have had more space to hold things. Oh man. Let's just stun those guys. Mark Prey. Honestly. Wow. That's perfect. They would work. that bleed on you. You don't have to deal with you anymore. Let's stack more battle ballads. We've been slightly nicked. This is point blank shot to eviscerate him. Let's throw some blight. That'll probably work, it did. <laughs> Escape Cloud! Hit us. Blighted one of us. It's just Dirk Stab. Move that Blight. We can finish him off. Oh ho ho, Sapphire. Seize this momentum. Portrait. Push on to the task's end. Let's get that holy water. Could have actually just used it, to be honest. Well, it's time to journey all the way there. Okay. Now we can leave if we want. But no, I, I gotta, I gotta pick all this up now. Good fortune and hard work may yet arrest this plague. A pitiful amount of money was discovered, but a lot of deeds. Nice to grab a few deeds. A tiny amount of portraits. Man, it would've been easier if I saw the quest location earlier. <laughs> But I completely didn't see it. So you got a nearing. So your rain skills are more damage. How useless. <laughs> You're also fascinated with corpses. Uh, you also got diseased because I, uh... I opened that grave. We got deadly. <laughs> That's pretty fitting for you, Jojo. Uh, Sigmund is calm, which is bad. And you have a guilty conscience, but you're luminous, which is good. That's pretty nice. Pallid light filters its way through the rotting boughs. Let us press on. I see. Sunshine in the thicket. 
wholesome plant life has been spotted in the surrounding wood. A rarity in these parts. Ah, so plus 33% resolve XP in the wield on next quest, and 50% damage in wield on next quest. So it's like Silence in the Crypts, just the wield version. Got it. What else happened? Uh, rabies was cured, and Curious was removed. That's good. Well, now I gotta remove other diseases. Like this one. I don't want to get rid of, like, guilty conscience and nervous. Nervous is bad, guilty conscience is also bad, but it might be a while till I use you. I don't know. I'm actually the most curious I am is honestly look at the stagecoach. There's an occultist who looks rather familiar. Um, there's imposter syndrome. I wonder why! <laughs> Consumed with thoughts of inadequacy. He also, I think, is an imposter, guys. And he will never drink, and he is a wheeled tactician. I will take you, occultist. You seem pretty neat. And we have an antiquar in here with Nervous Bleeder, Flawed Release, and Precision Striker. I'm probably just gonna take you because you're another antiquarian. And we have. The Shieldbreaker, who is an Eldritch Cater, Worn Scratcher, God Fearing, and has religious delusions. Scientific and Perfectionist, Thick Blood Lurker. That ain't that great. Gonna grab the Antiquarian. We're also gonna go to the Blacksmith here. And we're going to increase our Weaponsmithing to rank 3. I think that's a pretty nice one to have. Fan the Flames. Mold the metal. We are raising an army. And what we're also going to do is we're going to trade for one more portrait. From busts. We're going to get one portrait. And we're gonna get instruction mastery three as well. Some may fall, but their knowledge lives on. That is very good. And that means we only just need armor smithing level 2. And then we can get experienced recruits. So they'll... I think they... Well, I don't remember what level they start on. I feel like it's like 1. 1 or like 2. I don't know. But all of that is for next time, folks. Until then.